Okay, to show the correct way, um, from my experience on how to get the A-pillar trim, the garnish molding off your A-pillar on your Honda Element, 2003 to 2011. Um, a lot of videos I've seen, people pry up and you can break the somewhat complicated three-piece fasteners. So the way I found out to do it is you roll, kind of like you're rolling a burrito, you roll this trim towards the center of the windshield. Um, you're kind of locked in down at the bottom. So you start with the top and then it goes on an angle. You're kind of like angle rolling your burrito. Do it real quick. Let's see if I can get it started. designed to slide off as opposed to pop off. So, you got your five little fasteners and you can see one of them stayed on, but this is typically what you're left with. And if somebody's been there before and put these back on, you may see a bunch of goop holding on these clips. Buying new clips and putting on the clips. So um, that will pop off. So this is what a brand new clip looks like. It's designed to stop here, but this is the green part that goes on the A pillar. There's a little pin that this slides onto. And these are really complicated. There's a whole bunch of little ribs that lock everything in typically going on one way. So it slides on and locks on. Um, the way to get this off, the A-pillar off, and not have to replace these is by not prying up on the trim piece with a screwdriver, but trying to roll it. You're basically trying to slide these guys off of these green tabs. And that way you can reuse your A-pillar, your A-pillar trim. So, um, again, these are very complicated, uh, overly complicated clips, but when they put on right, they tend to work. 